Hello guys, me and Pokemon Hunter of Famous today we're doing an Obama to today's Bama match will be Zeo Abyss from Bayway versus Obito Uchiha from Naruto. Let's get into the connections. Um the connections between these two, both of them are antagonists who had the goal of being the strongest in the series, the world. Zeo um, had the goal of being number one, Obito wanted to be Hokage, something like that. Both were parts of teams of their two best friends, um, Kakashi and Rin for Obito, Masamune and Toby for Zio. And both of them are antagonists drive by the want for revenge over, a fr over one of the friends who they thought betrayed them, but they actually didn't, and found that out later and realized their mistakes. So yeah, both also, both also have abilities that make them almost impossible to hit. Zio has his, like, magn these magnetic stuff, which allows him to put away his opponent, Beyblades, and Obito can use Kamui to, like, make things phase through him. So, yeah, there's... So, those are connected. So let's get to who wins. Well, this fight is very interesting. It's very... It's like stats versus hacks, okay? Um, with Zio has stats, Obito has hacks. Zio can get to Universal and billions of times faster than light, while Obito can get to like Moon to Planetary and only faster than light. I Meaning that Zio one shots and blitzes, but Obito has a lot of hacks, right? He can destroy, whip out Zio's soul. Um, he can ascend him to a different dimension of Kamui. Um, he can just face through his attacks, he can even heal himself from, like, having have his body destroyed. While, uh, Zeo does also have soul hacks and can destroy the soul of the other Beyblades, right? And he does have mag magnetism, but the magnetism wouldn't really work on Obito, and the soul hacks would only even, would only, like, even that out, and even so Obito still has more ways to end the fight and has ways to survive long enough to do it. And if Obito is able to draw a fight on long enough, he could potentially just wait until Flame Bixis runs out of stamina. But, too bad, but sadly for Obito, um, uh, that is very unlikely because of a massive stack up I mentioned earlier. Universal versus Planetary, massive, massive gap, and billions of times faster is billions of times greater than f just faster than light. So. Zio is just way too strong and way, way too fast for Obito's hacks and abilities to really play an impact. Obito could potentially use his phasing to just outlast Flame Bixis' his stamina, which he could potentially do. It could just heal long enough or regenerate constantly so he could just eventually land a hit on. Zio, but Zio is just way faster, way stronger. He could just also have soul hacks, so he could just destroy Obito's soul to bypass the healing factor, right? So, you know, ultimately, Obito is a strong fighter, and his hacks could definitely put a good fight, but Zio is just way too strong, way too fast. Just, just way better stats. So, the winner of this battle match will be Zio Abyss from Beyblade. So, yeah, um, peace, guys. Remember, keep on playing Blade